have a little bit of that deployment. Um, so uh, we use the thing. So uh, another really important philosophy on our team is kill the server. Like I said, databases suck, right? Um, maintenance that sucks. Like I don't want to have to think about this site ever again after election night. I don't want to have to maintain it. I don't want to have a server to run. I don't want to worry about it going down in the middle of the night. None of it. So how do we get around? So we publish. So instead of this being a, a site that's actually running on Django that you're actually that you're live interacting with, like a traditional dynamic site, um, we bake out HTML and upload it to Amazon S3, and that's what you actually see: data files, pages, everything. And we just do it um, on several different timers for several different sections of the site. Um, so we were using a tool called Django Bakery, made by the LA Times. Ran into some bugs with it, filed bug reports, but we couldn't get those things fixed. Uh, uh, couldn't get them fixed by election night. So we switched over to use a product called uh, Django Medusa by a guy named Mike Tegas, um, open news developer, uh, Mozilla funded developer. Um, and so, um, and so that's what we used. And so that ran all night, um, every minute, uploading the latest local results. Every 10 minutes, uploading a new version of the latest homepage. If it changed, that's the other thing that's really important about this. If it changed, um, so if nothing changed, it didn't upload anything. Um, this keeps our costs way down as well. It never breaks. Um, we've used the uh, we've used this technique in national elections. So we used it in 2012. Um, we did not have as sophisticated data coverage as the Washington Post or the New York Times. Uh, Originally, they'll say they never went down. Um, and so uh, we were pretty happy about that. But um, just about everything that we create now, we fake out the static HTML and we upload to Amazon S3. Um, the other thing is that in years past, uh, an election night will often cost us several hundred or, or even more dollars in hosting costs, just in, in Amazon compute units. Um, handling all the traffic, I haven't looked at the bill, but handling all the traffic for uh, this last primary election, I think it's going to be like 10 bucks on Amazon S3. <laughs> um, it is so much cheaper to just bake the static files. So much cheaper. Um, and the boss is like that, right? Like That's, that's, that's a win for us um, on a whole lot of levels. At the expense of, of, of trying to make a system work that, that is viable to publish a site that's this complex. Um, all right.